Because I've, uh, I've looked at so many cone beam scan data sets, I've looked at and interpreted over 15,000 scans for my clients to date, um, it became clear that dentists were concerned about um, having to produce a formal report uh, for the data that's in their scan and maybe missing something. So with another partner, uh, Dr. Robert Danforth, uh, who's been teaching radiology about as long as I have, uh, we developed a templated anatomically based reporting mechanism or reporting uh, software called Easy Writer. And this software allows a dentist to go in and look at the anatomic regions in their scans step by step and populate uh, the report by just selecting statements uh, of what they think they see in the scan. When they finish, um, they put in information about the patient and the data about the scan. Then they populate areas like paranasal sinus, airway, temporomandibular joint, <coughs> excuse me, osseous changes, uh, temporomandibular joint, uh, dental findings, and other. And in several categories, there are things that the dentist is not used to seeing in, in all of this data uh, on their panoramics or intraoral films. And so they get nervous about, you know, will I miss something? Easy Writer actually directs them through the report uh, it's electronic, it can be mailed, it can be put into their practice management system, and it makes the reporting easy and makes them a lot less likely to miss anything, thus reducing their risk and liability. Um, when you look at these data sets, you're looking at anatomic regions that only have a certain number of findings that are available in each of those areas. For example, the paranasal sinuses, lots of inflammatory changes, on a rare occasion a tumor or a cyst, uh, the features of which are described in the statement. So it's very, very simple to select, click on the statement, make sure that that's in the report. At the end, there are uh, recommendations uh, for that significant finding that will go into the report as well, including uh, referral. Uh, and in a future actual version of the software, we're going to put in uh, templated referral letters for the different specialists that we will refer to.